Welcome back, guys. So, basically, we put in our mixture. All we did was we put um, two tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of garlic powder, and two tablespoons of ground ginger. So what we're going to do, now this is basically the mixture that's going to go on top of our pork chops. I'm going to keep mixing it. And Zane, Doug, and Nicholas requested that I make this video. So, got, so for my best bros out there, I'm making this for you guys. And like I told you, this is going to cook on low for eight hours. So, okay. So, this is basically what the mixture looks like now. We're going to go over to the slow cooker, and I don't know if you guys can really see the crock pot, but if I think I can probably aim this to where you guys can see it a little. Alright, now we're going to go over, head over to our slow cooker, and we're going to get started. I wish this just stay up so that way I can... Hold on a minute, guys. I'm trying to figure this out. There we go. Okay, guys. So let's get started. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw our pork chops in. So these are boneless pork chops. And we're going to throw them into our slow cooker. And now that I aimed my camera right, guys, you guys can see the crock pot. Okay? So we're going to throw in our pork chops. And it, it does have a little bit of fat, but we're going to we won't worry about that. It's going to cook all day. And as this cooks all day, now I'm making, let's see, we have four in the crock pot now. This is going to be a total of six pork chops. I know that's a lot, but we, we are a family of six, so we're making six pork chops anyway. So that means there's going to be one left over. It's fine. Okay. So. Now, this is basically what you want your pork chop. Now, I won't I won't do that just yet. I'll do that when I get the apricot reserved in there. Okay. So now. I'll put that. In the I'm going to pour this mixture on top. And I should have not. The apricot mixture is going to go on top of the pork chop. So, and it's totally fine because all this stuff is just going to be, I'm going to spread this around and we'll get this heated up. Now, you guys have been with me for a long time. You guys know already that I love to do crock pot meals. And you guys know that, now, you guys have been with me for a long time. You guys already know this. I love to get my slow cooker nice and heated. And I know some people don't do that. The re now, the reason why I started doing that was because it's just a little easier um, to just handle. You guys get what I'm saying? It's just a little easier. This video is going to be so good, and I promise you it's going to be delicious. There's no reason why this video is going to go wrong. Because I promise you, it's going to be good. Now, at the end of the day, later today, in the later this afternoon, then I'll come back and I'll show you what the pork chops look like. So what I'm going to do is... I'll show you guys something. So look at this. Okay, guys. So, that's basically it. So... I'm going to wash my hands, and then I'll put the lid on. Now, this video is um, it, it's an easy video. Now, the recipe that I showed you guys last night, you guys remember the yellow rice video? That video is good, too. But I think this video is really going to actually cover it. It's really going to be good. It's really delicious. It's not really that difficult to me. And I promise you, if you guys try this recipe, you guys are going to go... You guys are going to go crazy over it. Trust me. So, what we're going to do now... Where's my lid? 
Oh. All right. Lid on. I'm going to cook this on low, and we're going to go on low for about six to eight hours. I know that sounds like a long time, but this meal, actually, before we do that, this is basically what the pork chops in there look like. You guys can see the apricot reserve. That's done. So, my soak is doing a great job. It's already heating. Lid on. I'm going to turn this up. It's on low, and we're going to cook this for eight hours. After eight hours, I'll come back. I'll show you what, what it looks like, and then that'll be our video. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this. Bye. Vlog on.